I'm going to give tools today. Let's do a battle of the brushes against the DeWalt, Makita, Hilti, and Flex drill drivers. Now, these drill drivers aren't as powerful as the Brigger Brothers, so we're, we are going to do the proper test to see which one of these actually prevail over the other. Flex, Hilti, and DeWalt all have fully metal half-inch chucks, and the Makita is the only one with a plastic housing. Let's do a simple light test and see how long these lights stay on until after you pull the trigger. Makita's light is located underneath the clutch. 10.31 seconds for the Makita. Hilti's light is located on the base of the tool. 10.94 seconds. The Flex's light is also located on the base of the tool. 10.61 seconds. And the DeWalt actually has a few options. You can have the light off. You can have it on temporarily. Or you can use it as a 20-minute work light. We are going to test that. Let's have it on temporarily. And let's see how long this light actually stays on. And the DeWalt for the win is 19.64 seconds. And the last place is the Makita with 10.31 seconds. We are going to test out the 20 minute work light. Let's see how long this actually lasts. And as you can see, it actually does let us stay on for 20 minutes. The Makita is 3 pounds and 12.4 ounces. The Hilti is 4 pounds and 5.5 ounces. The Flex is 5 pounds and 6.8 ounces. And the DeWalt is 4 pounds and 4.3 ounces. If tool weight is a factor in your purchase, the Flex weighs 5 pounds and 6.8 ounces, and the Makita weighs 3 pounds and 12.4 ounces. In the 6x6, we are going to test out a 6-inch Timberlock, a 6-inch by 3-8 inch lag, and a 6-inch by half inch lag. Makita's battery is full. We're doing speed 2. 1.83 seconds. Hilti's using a 4 amp hour battery. Hilti does not make a 5 amp hour battery. Battery is full. Speed 2. 1.48 seconds. Flex is on speed 2 as well. 5 amp hour battery. Battery is full. 1.16 seconds. The DeWalt has a 5 amp hour battery as well. It does have an adjustable light. And the battery is full. 1.22 seconds. And Flex is the winner with 1.16 seconds. And Makita is last place with 1.83 seconds. Makita is XFD131. $159 for a kit 18 volt tool. 440 inch pounds, 1900 RPM, 300 year, 300 year, three year warranty. 1.67 seconds for the Makita. 1.37 seconds for the Hilti. 1.11 seconds for the Flex. And 1.24 seconds for the DeWalt. Flex for the win with 1.11 seconds. This is going to be a tag team test with a 3 8 inch by 6 inch lag. We are going to see what it can do on speed 2, then we're going to finish it on speed 1. We're going to do this for all tools. 3.97 seconds for the Makita. For the Hilti's SF4 A22, it's a 22 volt tool, $119 tool only. 549 inch pounds of torque, 2100 RPM, and Hilti's 22 1 warranty. Drove it in further, but not quite. Let's finish that on speed one. 2.75 seconds for the Hilti. 2.05 seconds for the Flex. Oh, that wall almost got it, but not quite. We're going to finish it on speed one. 1.97 seconds for the win on DeWalt. Last place is Makita at 3.97 seconds. We are going to take these out on speed one for the rest of this test on this 6x6. 5.77 seconds for the Makita. 4.15 seconds for the Hilti. And the model number for the Flex is FX1151Z. 24 volt tool, $119 tool only, 750 inch pounds of torque, 2200 RPM, and a lifetime limited warranty. 4.05 seconds for the flex. And the DeWalt got 3.80 seconds for the win, with last place is Makita at 5.77 seconds. Let's drive into the six inch by half inch lag on speed one. 6.61 seconds for the Makita. 4.91 seconds for the Hilti. 4.35 seconds for the flex. The DeWalt model number is DCD800P1, 20 volt tool, 
$135 tool, only 796 inch pounds of torque, 2000 RPM, and three year limited warranty. The wall shot 3.67 seconds for the win. And last place is Makita at 6.61 seconds. We are going to take these out on speed one. 5.66 seconds for the Makita. 3.91 seconds for the Hilti. 3.37 seconds for the Flex. Up oh, the DeWalt slipped. 3.55 seconds for the DeWalt and for the win is Flex with 3.37 seconds and for the last place is Makita at 5.66 seconds. This might not be a legitimate test, but it still is cool to see. Six point thirty one seconds for the Makita. We are doing speed two on all tools. Six point fifty five seconds for the Hilti. Three point thirty seven seconds for the Flex. And 4.3 seconds for the DeWalt. First place is Flex with 3.37 seconds. And the last place again is Makita with 6.31 seconds. Next, let's do a three quarter inch drill bit. Let's see what these can do. Now, this test is going to be on speed two. We are going to see if these can do two in a row. And if not, we'll switch over to speed one for all of them. Makita failed on speed two. So let's switch to speed one and do two holes in a row without stopping. Twelve point seven seconds to Makita. Hilti is next. Let's try speed two. It has to do two holes in a row. If not, we'll do speed one. Hilti failed two holes in a row, so we are going to switch over to speed one. Nine point eight two seconds for the Hilti. Let's see if Flex can do two holes in a row on speed two. Flex failed, so we will switch switch to speed one and do the test from there. Remember, these are compact tools, you guys. These are not as powerful as their bigger brothers. Each of these brands' bigger uh, hammer drills could actually do these do this task on speed two. DeWalt is next. Let's see if DeWalt can do this on speed two. And surprisingly, DeWalt is the only one that can do it on speed two in 2.85 seconds for the win. And 12.7 seconds for the Nikita. I'm surprised about that, that DeWalt did that on speed two. That's a, with a regular five amp hour battery. All right, next let's do a one and a half inch speed bore. This is a tough task to do, you guys. Their bigger hammer drill brothers have trouble doing this on speed two, but we're, we're gonna do speed one. Let's see what these tools can do. We are gonna do a test that, uh, after the speed one test and see if these could even do them on speed two. 10.50 seconds for the Makita. 6.82 seconds for the Hilti. Five point nine eight seconds for the flex. And the DeWalt got five point zero three seconds. DeWalt for the win with five point zero three seconds. And last place again is Bikita at ten point fifty seconds. Let's find out and see if the, any of these tools can do this on speed two. Makita just failed. This is a tough task for speed two, you guys. Hilti failed as well.
flex failed as well. And the Dewalt failed. All of them failed that test. Final temperature is 103 for the Makita. Battery is full on the 5 amp hour battery. 109 degrees for the Hilti. 4 amp hour battery has 3 bars left. That's not bad. 101 degrees for the Flex. 5 amp hour battery is still full. 140 degrees for the DeWalt. And the 5 amp hour battery is still full as well. One more time for the pricey guys. $159 for as a kit only. I cannot find that Makita Jewel Driver separate. You could probably find it on eBay or Amazon. Hilti and Flex are $119 tool only. The DeWalt is $135 tool only. For the final score, the Makita and Hilti only won one each. And the top two tools is DeWalt and Flex. Six wins for the DeWalt, five wins for the Flex. And of course, that means DeWalt won in this video. Clearly the DeWalt is the winner in this video. This thing is powerful, it's very compact. And I can't believe that this actually did the two three quarter inch holes in, on speed two nonstop. That's actually pretty impressive. Out of these four, the one that I actually would recommend is the Flex. And that's mainly because the Flex out of these four is the only one with a handle. Hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.